Hey guys, it's X, and welcome to another video. For those of you who don't know, yesterday uh, CNanners held an open lobby for Minecraft. He put it out on his Twitter, I got his tweet on my phone, my cell phone, and I jumped, I jumped on the uh, link that he provided, and I was able to get in, which was pretty cool. Uh, I was actually just getting home, and I was about to go to bed when he put out his tweet, and I tried the link real quick, thinking maybe I can get in. I got in, so there was no way I was going to bed for the next hour or so after that even though I was really tired it was still a whole lot of fun real quick I want to give a few shout outs to a few of the people that were there first of all Jack 1237 this guy was fun he was cool to play with uh, secondly legit cake he was really helpful to me uh, his username is a project UK on YouTube so uh, go check him out when you get a chance uh, Rawberry I really gotta thank Rawberry because I didn't know how to record the game when it was running in a browser window because I usually download the exe file and I run and I actually played the exe file on my on my PC, but I didn't know how to record it if it was running in a browser, and Rawberry showed me how to do that using Fraps, so I couldn't have made this video without him, so thank you very much, Rawberry. And of course, you gotta give a shout out to CNanners, it was his open lobby, so it was really awesome. And we got to see a whole bunch of cool things being built, like we all got in there, and CNanners just said, okay, everybody pick a spot and start building something, so everybody on the server just started building a whole bunch of really random and cool stuff. Uh, I saw like I saw a giant 8-bit Mario. That was really that was epic. I saw a giant toad, also from Mario. Uh, we also saw a uh, Rawberry's treehouse, and they tried to trap me in it, but I found a way. <laughs> I found a way out of there. Um, there were a couple of Cnanner signs too, like a multicolored one, and there was one made out of wood. Uh, someone made a, a giant YouTube logo. I think that was Legit Cake, a Project UK. I think he made the giant YouTube logo. Um, as for myself, I tried to build a replica of the X-Fort, but that didn't turn out very well. I needed the mountain behind it for it to work, and I wasn't about to build a mountain, so I had everybody tear that down. And then I just ended up building a replica of the Greenhouse of Harmony, but it, it just kind of got drowned out by all the other things that were being built around it. Like, so much was going on, but the Greenhouse of Harmony just didn't stand a chance of looking cool amongst all that stuff. But uh, underneath the Greenhouse of Harmony, I proceeded to build a, a small miniature Station 1. I don't have any footage of that. But I had a miniature station one down there, like a little tunnel going to it. And uh, I attached that to the greenhouse. And Jack1237, he took the idea a little bit further. And he attached a, a miniature X-Lite 9000 to it. I called it the X-Lite 2000. It was pretty cool. Uh, but the coolest thing that I saw on, that got built on the server was uh, CNanner's giant robot. Uh, he built it all by himself. Really tall robot. He's kind of got his arm extended out there. It looks really awesome. And <laughs> when he was done, it... Uh, looked like he was trying to run away from it in terror. Uh, all in all, it was just a very enjoyable experience, and I would absolutely love to do that again, so I'll be keeping an eye on CNN's Twitter for that. And you all should go do that as well because uh, I had a really, really good time. It was really fun. So uh, thanks a lot for showing up, everybody, and I'll see you on the next video.